That only grew about 10% uh, last year. Um, we uh, just uh, broke the uh, 800 million mark uh, for the first time for any PR firm, um, which is great. Um, we had uh, pretty good growth across the uh, geographies, um, about 7% in the U.S. Uh, in double digits for the other regions in the world. The growth was driven by both uh, organic um, growth of our existing clients, but also some important new wins. Edelman made two important acquisitions uh, this year. Um, we bought a, a creative boutique uh, in Sweden called uh, Deportivo, um, which uh, actually has uh, led us to um, being um, able to deploy them across the uh, continent um, and brilliant creative campaigns that win awards at can. Also, we acquired Elan, um, in Paris, the leading independent firm, uh, and the agency now is called uh, Elon Edelman, um, about 140 people. Um, and uh, we're working for some very important French companies. We also um, made a very important um, strategic relationship with uh, United Talent Agency um, for us to acquire a majority interest in uh, United Entertainment Group, and we put our Matter subsidiary into it, um, and together a $30 million business. Um, and, uh, for example, we just uh, worked with uh, Jay-Z and Rock Nation uh, to announce its uh, program for, for streaming music today, uh, co-owned by artists. So that's indicative of the kind of work it enables us to do. Um, we feel strongly that um, the uh, smart companies will see that uh, brands and uh, reputations are, are inextricably linked. Um, also that uh, stories need to be told, um, starting with earned media um, and uh, then moving into the uh, paid sphere. Um, we also believe that there's real growth um, with uh, owned media, so to speak, uh, creative newsrooms, um, and that uh, that will be a tremendous growth engine next year.